All right, so for this question, we need to find the standard deviation, and they're asking for the coefficient of variation for the BMIs of the uh, 1920s and 1930s pageant winners. So we need to find standard deviation of that data set. All right, so what I need to do first to, to calculate standard deviation is we're going to click Stat and Edit, and we're going to enter those numbers from the first row into my list. All right, so 20.4, 21.8, and so on. So let me enter the data. Alright, so I entered all the data. Notice it's under L1. That's list 1. Alright, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to click stat, calc, and I'm going to do one variable stats, and I'm going to do one variable stats for list 1. So notice I click second, and then I click 1. See the little yellow L1 there above 1? That's going to give me L1, and so I'll get one variable stats for that. So the number I'm looking for here is the standard deviation, which is going to be, uh, let's call it uh, 1.4 uh, 6, 9, 1.47, let's call it that. So that's the number I need. S equals 1.47. Now this uh, coefficient of variation is kind of a hokey thing to be honest. Um, it's not something I've ever seen used in real life, but the coefficient of variation is this standard deviation divided by x bar, which is the sample mean. So let's go back and actually look at the camera and get, or the calculator, excuse me, and get the uh, X bar, X bar is 20.17. Alright, so to get this coefficient, we're going to take 1.47 and divide it by 20.17. Alright, so I have my calculator here, uh, 1.47 divided by 20.17. So that um, coefficient of variation is going to be 0 0.073. And it actually says round to one decimal place, so we'll call that 0 0.7. All right. And sorry, we actually need to convert that to a percentage, my mistake. So they need, they want the percentage. I missed that part right there. Then we need a percent. So looking back at the calculation again, it's, uh, if we move the decimal over to it, it's 7.28 or 7.3%. So we'll call that 7.3%. Now the next part of the question says to go do that for the recent beauty, beauty beauty pageant winners. So what we can do here, we can do stat edit again, and we'll go to list two this time and put the second set of data in list two. And when we get that finished, um, we can, I'll show you how we'll do. And so we have that data in here. So now we'll do stat, calc, one bar stats, and now we'll do L2. So we can uh, do the second list, and we get the same information uh, presented to us, but of course the numbers are different. So we take S, we need S is 1.168, and we need X bar, which is going to be 18.77. Alright, so when we take S divided by X bar this time, we get... All right, and then multiply by 100 is another way to convert to a percent. So we'll call that uh, 6.2 will be the answer there. And then the final part of the question just says, look, is there is there some variation between these two data sets? And we would say no. Uh, one was 7.3 and one was 6.2. That's that's pretty close together. The one is a little bit less. There's a little bit less variation. Um, but from what we see, there's... Uh, there's really not a lot of difference between these two numbers. That's a little bit subjective, but you can see that they're one is six, one of them seven percent, and that's very close.